behind this mask because me and the mask are not friends, but I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. So thank you, thank you, thank you. We are so excited. Oh, yes, we are. We are back. Thank the you, The Get Jesus. Ready Evening Show. That's right. We are back. Mm-hmm. And we prayed, I prayed, and I asked God, when are we supposed to come back? And it just popped up now. So I called Reverend Hampton, and I said, we're going back November. So I prayed in October, and it just came up now. And so we're back. So we thank you so much for tuning in. Mm -hmm. Listen to a heart showered by God. And for those who knew us in March of 2019, we're back. So I am Reverend Valerie Granberry, and my co-host is Reverend Cheryl Hampton. We come to you by radio, and we come in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. And so we thank the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And some people might be saying, why do they say all that? Because we want you to be clear of the God that we serve. So we serve the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Mm -hmm. We have come to encourage our listeners. We have a passion. We have a deep passion. We have such a passion that God has given us this assignment. Mm -hmm. And it's not free to sit in these seats. No, it's not. So that's the passion that we have. We feel like it's an, it's an awesome opportunity to be able to spread God's word. And so we thank you for tuning in. We come to those who you may not have a church. Some churches are back in the building. Some churches are through social media. If for whatever reason you stop going to church, even if today you tuned into your church, we like to say this is a nighttime treat Mm -hmm. to put you to sleep. And so we like to declare Esther 4, 14, 15, and 16. We want you to decide and declare, decide if you are called for such a time as this and be like Declare, if I perish, I perish. And so we understand the times that we are living in. We understand that they are detrimental times. But we do understand we belong to God. Mm -hmm. We believe in Jesus. We believe in the Holy Spirit. I just absolutely love being able to say Mm -hmm. the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. That's right. Because you know what? So many people claim God, period. Mm -hmm. But Jesus says, you cannot get to God without him. That's right. And so you can't separate the two. That's right. So we are absolutely excited Mm -hmm. to have an opportunity to be back on the air again. Mm -hmm. The Get Ready Evening Show. Oh, yes. Reverend Hampton. I am so excited about being back on the radio I know it's been rough. It's been tough going through the coronavirus, Mm -hmm. but God is still good. Yes, Lord. God has been taking care of us through this whole ordeal. That's right. And God will still take care of us. That's right. So just keep the faith and hang in there. That's right. Because I believe that he will send a cure after a while. That's right. You know, for some reason, he allowed this to happen. That's right. And, you know, whatever he does, we can't do anything about it. He's in control. That's right. Because this not this didn't come up on surprise to him. That's right. It was not a surprise. That's right. He knew from the beginning that this was going to happen. That's right. And that's what I love about God. Mm-hmm. Nothing catches him by surprise. That's right. He's an all-knowing God. All-knowing. 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 And so he knows all things. That's right. And he knows how long this is going to last. That's right. So we just got to have a little patience. That's right. Until he says it's enough. That's right. You know, I was looking at John chapter uh, 1. And um, Reverend Granberry was telling you earlier about what this radio show is about and so the radio show again is about 
the sick and shut in. It's about those that have left their church and is looking for a church home. Those that are out there and don't know which way to go. This radio is show is designed to encourage you. That's right. To get in a house of prayer. That's right. I'm telling you, you need That's to right. find a house of prayer and to stay in it because it is getting late. That's right. And so you need to be ready when Jesus come back. And so I was looking um, at John 1 and and when I was saying that God knows all things and, and that nothing catches him by surprise, John 1 says, in the beginning was the word. In the beginning was the one who is called the word. The word was with God and the word was truly God. From the very beginning, the word was with God. And so as you, des as you decide which direction it goes to, the, okay, the word of God okay. is what you need to be looking at. You need to be reading the word of God and meditating on the word of God for directions. He was in the beginning, and he's in the beginning. He's right now. So everyone needs to find a church home. We're trying to encourage you to find a church home and stay focused on God. Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. And so... We are just so excited to be here. Mm -hmm. We're so excited to be back in these seats mm -hmm. where we believe we were assigned mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. for such a time as this. That's right. And so we're excited when we go to God and he says, now mm -hmm. it's time to go back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we don't understand why or what God is saying, why he's saying it. Mm -hmm. But if we know it's God, we just do it. That's right. Because if we think about it, mm -hmm. when I said, God, when should we go back to the radio show? Mm -hmm. Do you think Satan would be telling us to go back to spread the good news? Oh, no. No. Mm -mm. No. Mm -hmm. So when it came to me now, Satan wouldn't be telling us that. That's right. Because he doesn't want God's word to get out. That's right. And so we are so excited to be here. Mm -hmm. We are going to go into prayer. Mm -hmm. And I know... Valerie Howard always listens, dedicated mm -hmm. listener, mm -hmm. never missed a show. Mm -hmm. My husband, Mark Granberry, mm -hmm. never missed a show. Mm -hmm. And so Amen. if you guys, everybody who's going to be able to hear us, they know we have we go into prayer. Mm -hmm. But you can call in if you have a prayer request. That's right. So the call in number is 609-807. 2492 609-807-2492 Now before we go into prayer, you can call in if you have a request. Mm -hmm. And we are really, really, really so excited. I looked back at our notes from our first call in person. We're excited. <laughs> so I look back at our first caller. And it was Mike. And Mike was calling out of Willenboro. And so we're happy about that. Mm -hmm. You could be our first caller mm -hmm. since we've been back for Corona. That's right. Because we're keeping log of what you're asking for. Mm -hmm. And we're keeping call, uh, log of who called in. Who called in? And if you want to tell us what your what your, your prayer was for, or you can just say, I just want general prayer. Mike wanted general prayer. You can be specific, but we are logging down our prayer request mm -hmm. because this radio show is for you. That's right. God has assigned us Esther for mm -hmm. for such a time as this. That's right. So you can call in 609-807-2492. Reverend Hampton? I just want to um, say a few names that we need to keep in prayer that's going through some things while we're getting ready for prayer. We are remembering some of our church members 
that are sick. Uh, Deacon Pure, Deacon Myers, Deacon and Deacon S. Green, Deacon S. Peterson, Deacon Oatman, Brother and Sister Thomas, Brother and Sister Curtis. We are remembering tonight Brother Thompson. We're remembering tonight Brother and Sister Kegler. Sister Johnson and Sister Stewart. There's so, so many sick. We're remembering Sister Wiggins on tonight. We're remembering Sister Hilda Jones and Cynthia Gaskins. There's so many sick. We want to remember them. We want to remember that there is power in prayer. That's right. The Bible tells us that men ought to always pray and not faint. Pray, pray without ceasing. We gotta be consistent in our prayer life. We believe that God is still able. That's right. To answer prayer. That's right. He is still in the healing business That's today. Right. That's right. So if you have a prayer request, you still believe in the power of prayer, call us. 609-807-2492. That's right. Call us if you still believe in the power of prayer. That's right. So in the meantime, while we give a few minutes for prayer, for people to call in for prayer, Reverend Hampton had started before we went off the air for Corona. She started the hot topic. Mm -hmm. So... Mm -hmm. We thought our hot topic for tonight mm -hmm. would be our new president-elect. <laughs> and the vice president. And the vice president. Mm -hmm. So there are so many people excited mm -hmm. about the new president-elect, mm -hmm. Joe Biden, mm -hmm. and his vice, his VP, mm -hmm. Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris, that's right. And so this is our hot topic. Mm-hmm. So we want, and this is something that came up before, mm -hmm. people's choice. Mm -hmm. Did God allow the people to choose mm. or is it God's will mm. that these two, Joe Biden and his VP, mm -hmm. be our next presidents for 2021? Right. So there's such a debate on the people's choice mm -hmm. because if everybody remembers Remember what King saw mm -hmm. when the people mm -hmm. wanted a king? Oh, yes. And so I remember. my question mm -hmm. is, is it the people's choice mm -hmm. or is it God's will? Okay. God's will. I'm going to give you a little bit of time to, to meditate on that. Mm -hmm. Think about that. Mm -hmm. We're still waiting for prayer requests. Yes. We're going to wait another second or two. Yes. And then we're going to open with prayer. So think about our hot mm -hmm. topic. Our new president-elect and his VP, was that the people's choice that God allowed because mm -hmm. he gives us free will? Mm -hmm. Was it the people's choice because of free will mm -hmm. or God's will? Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. So that is something we're going to address after we do our prayer. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you. Thank you. There's a new way to listen into the radio show, so we're not sure who's listening and who is not. And since this is our first night back, mm -hmm. we're still getting some things ironed out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But for those that are listening, this is a nighttime treat mm -hmm. to put you to sleep. Mm -hmm. Reverend Hampton, can you do prayer for us? Oh, yes. Father, we come in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. We have come in the name of the Lord. We come giving you thanks for Jesus who gave himself for us. Yes, God. So that he might redeem us from all iniquity and purify unto himself. Oh, yes. A peculiar people. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, yes, we Lord. say thank you. Thank you, Jesus. That we have been redeemed. Oh, yes. We say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. That you are making us a peculiar people for yourself, oh, oh God. Oh, yes. 
We need to be a peculiar people yes, Lord. in yes, this Lord. day yes, and time, yes, Lord. God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, some Jesus. people set aside, hmm. hallelujah, to do your will, oh God. Oh, yes. To show that there's a difference in the Christians and in the world, God. Yes, God. Lord, Thank we you, ask Jesus. you right yes, now Lord. in the yes, name Lord. of yes, Jesus. Lord. Yes, Lord. Help us be that mm. people, Lord, the, the peculiar people oh, yes. in this evil time, Yes, God. Lord. Yes, God. And so, Father, we come thanking you for Thank the Holy you, Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And Holy yes, Spirit, Lord. Spirit, we ask you right now, right in, the now, right now right now in the name of Jesus, if you will dwell among us right oh, now. Oh, yes. Holy Spirit, we welcome you yes, to Lord, be Holy among Spirit, us right welcome. now oh, in yes. Jesus' name. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes, oh, yes. But we want to do the will of God. Oh, yes. For it's all about the will yes, of God. Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, and so, Lord. Holy yes, Lord. Spirit, we ask you to have your way have right your way, now. God. Yes, Lord. Right have now your way. with us. In the name of We're Jesus. We're waiting yes, Lord. on you, Holy Ghost. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. In the name yes, Lord. of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, oh, Jesus. Oh, yes. Open up the floodgates yes. right now. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Yes, and Lord. have yes, your Lord. way right have now. Way, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Thank Spirit. Thank you for dwelling among us. Thank you, Lord. Oh, God. we ask you right now in the name yes, of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, because Lord. Yes, you Lord. are a healer, God. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You are still a healer, God. Yes, Lord. Thank you, You are God. a yes, miracle Lord. worker, God. A miracle God. worker. Yes, Lord. And so, Father, we lift up every yes, name we call oh, tonight, yes. God. Yes, God. Lord, every prayer request, yes, oh God, Lord. Yes, Lord. that yes, we Lord. have and that yes, you know Lord. about. Oh, yes. Lord, we lift them up unto yes, Lord. you, God. In the name of oh Jesus. God, because you are able. You said, pray for one another that you might be healed. And the effectual fervent prayer of the righteous. Oh, yes. Hallelujah, you said they are valid much. Yes, God. Touch right now, God. Yes, Lord. Touch right now. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Somebody need a touch right now, God. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Touch it right yes, now, Lord. God. Yes, Lord. Lord, yes, we Lord. believe yes, Lord. by faith that you are healing yes, them right yes, now, Lord. God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. According to their faith, yes, Lord. according yes, Lord. to yes, your will, oh, God. Yes. Have mercy right yes, now, God. Yes, Lord, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let grace work for them, God. Thank you, Lord. Oh, have mercy, God. Yes, Lord. We know that you are able. Yes, Lord. Oh, thank you, God. Yes, We just give you all the glory right now. Yes, Lord. Thank you for being a healer. Thank you, God. Thank you for touching them right now. Jesus. Oh, we just give you all the glory. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes. Anyone that needs you, God, emotionally. Yes, Lord. Lord, touch them right now, God. Yes, Lord. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Yes, God. Oh, yes. God. You know, yes, God. There's so much going on in this yes, world, God. Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, somebody needs you to touch them, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes. yes you're Lord. a healer, God. Oh, yes. You're a healer. Yes, Lord. And thank you, thank Jesus. thank you right now. Thank you, Lord. By faith. God. Yes, Lord. That they're healed in Jesus' yes, name. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name. You remember every name I call. Yes, God. Touch them one by one. Yes, Lord. In the mighty name in of Jesus, name I pray. Of Jesus. Oh, yes, God. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Thank you, God. You're so good, God. Yes, Lord. You're so merciful. Yes, Lord. And we won't forget to say thank you. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. For all we ask. Yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm going to add on to Reverend Hampton's prayer. And I'm going to ask you, Lord God. Hallelujah. Because we did get a text mm. about prayer. Thank you, God. And it was a text from my husband. Jesus. And he said, add us into your prayer. Okay. And so I'm going to pray. Thank you, God. And Father God, I'm going to say thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Lord God, you are in full control. Hallelujah. And Father God, nothing can happen that you do not allow. Hallelujah, God. And so, Father God, I just say thank you, thank, thank you, you thank you. Thank, thank you, you for my husband. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for all that you Hallelujah, do. Hallelujah, God. Father God, for mm. all the marriages, yes, for God. all the husbands and wives yes. that are listening, oh God. Yes, God. Especially, oh God, for Jesus. the Christian husbands and wives. Yes, God. We understand, oh God, mm. that the devil is busy. Oh, 
And Father God, we thank you that you have given us power. We thank you, O oh God, that you have allowed us to say, Get thee behind me, Satan. We thank you, O oh God, that you have given us strength. We thank you, O oh God, that you allow us to study your word and to know what your word says. So now, Father God, we ask you to help us to be doers of your word. Oh, yes, God. For we can read the word and quote the word all day long. Yes, God. But, Father God, power comes in when power. we use the word. Yes, God. Power comes in when we live the word. Yes, Lord. Help us, oh God, the married yes, couples. God. Help yes. the Christian married couples, yes, oh God, God to be us. about your business. Yes, God. To let each one of us know, oh God, mm -hmm. that we represent you. Yes, Lord. Not by what people see, Jesus. but by what's in our hearts. Oh, yeah. By how we walk this thing out. Yes, God. Father God, help us to understand that that's where Hallelujah, our power comes God. to resist the enemy. Yes, God. When we are fueled by your anointing. Yes, God. When we are fueled by your Holy Spirit. Yes, Lord. Father God, when we tell the devil, you are a liar. Oh, yes. Father God, because we know all kinds of things yes, come to our mind mm -hmm. all day long. Jesus. But Father God, in the name of Jesus, Satan, I rebuke Jesus. you. Satan, you Jesus. must flee. Yes. Satan, you have no charge here. Jesus. Satan, you are a liar. Yes. Satan, you are doomed. Yes. Satan, Jesus is in full control. Yes. Yes, yes God. Lord. Yes, God. I claim that over the marriages, oh, yes. oh God, oh, including yes. mine. Yes, Father God. God, help us to understand that mm -hmm. it is not what we say. Yeah. That it is not what people see. Yes. But God. it is what is in our hearts. Yes, God. What we live out. Because the people are not in control. Jesus. What they see is not in control. Thank you, but God. Father God, you are in control. You are and in you control. know the heart. Oh, yes. We ask you in the name of Jesus, yes, help God. us to know, oh God, yes, God. that our hearts, mm -hmm. our actions are accountable to you. Yes, God. Help them to understand, oh God, that you have placed a husband and wife in yes. charge. Yes, God. Help us to understand, oh God, that our mm -hmm. children are watching. Yes, that God. our neighbors are watching, that oh, our loved ones are watching. Yeah. And Thank that's yeah. how we get the power yes, when God. we do what you have called us to do. Oh, yes. So strengthen us, oh God, in you. In the Equip name us, of Jesus. oh God, in you. Yes, help God. us to understand a dying world is watching us. Yes. Thank and help us God. to understand, most importantly, oh God, mm -hmm. those within our household oh, yes. is watching us. Oh, yes. Father God, the power Jesus. is what changes things. Jesus. That anointing Jesus. is what causes us to resist Hallelujah. the devil. We need you, thank and you we God. cannot make it without you. Yes, God. We thank you for every Christian marriage. Oh, yes. We thank you, oh God, mm -hmm. for even if you're not married, Jesus. all the Christians. Yes, God. We thank you, oh God, even mm -hmm. for the people, oh God. Yes. Because God. you reign on the just and the unjust. Yes. As you drew us closer to you, oh God. Yes, God. As we began to study your word, we mm -hmm. understood that we have to come together in marriage. Oh, yes. And so, Father God, we Hallelujah. say thank you. Thank you, God. Let your will be done. Yes, God. We need you, and I pray every Thank night. You, we God. always need you. Hallelujah. Not what you did yesterday, Jesus. but what you do yesterday, today, and forevermore. Hallelujah. Father God, we cannot rest on Jesus. what he did for me yesterday. Jesus. God, I need you today. Yes. We need you today. Yes, God. And we will need you again tomorrow. Yes, God. In the name of Jesus. And I know my neighbor Val is listening. Continue to strengthen her body. Yes, God. Continue to strengthen her marriage. Yes, God. Continue to strengthen her family. Thank you, Lord Jesus. God, we need you to look over Kenya. Yes. And we need you to look over Teresa. Mm -hmm. And there's so many on the list. Mother Barron, mm -hmm. Lord God, there are so many that need mm -hmm. that healing mercy that Reverend Hampton prayed about. Yes, God. So we come to you asking. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord. Thank you for this Thank time. You, God. Thank you for this time. Thank you, Jesus. And those we didn't mention, oh God, mm -hmm. you know them. Oh, yes. You know them. Mm -hmm. You know them. Oh, yes. My cousin, Suki, mm -hmm. she needs you, God, in a mighty way. Yes. My cousin, Suki, needs you, Lord God. Mm -hmm. There are so many on the prayer list. There are so oh, yes. many that we know that are incarcerated so that need you, Lord God. Yes, God. And we know that you hear the prayers of yes, the righteous. God. So we thank you for it. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' name. Yes, God. Amen. Amen. And listeners, if we think about it, this is so heavy on me and Reverend Hampton's heart. Mm -hmm. Because Reverend Hampton prays a long prayer. Jesus. 
And you know what? Too many people say it don't take all that, but it does take all that. Oh, yes, it does. See, when we go before God, we should not be rushing. That's right. We should not be in a hurry. That's right. Because if we think about it, let us think about when we call to God. Mm -hmm. What if God said, I don't have time? That's right. I'm in a hurry. Mm -hmm. I'm in a rush. Mm -hmm. So, so many people think you are to rush through the things of God. Mm -hmm. And that's not so. That's right. The more time we give to God, mm -hmm. the more time God will give to us. That's right. And so we thank God mm -hmm. for that long introduction. Jesus. We thank God mm -hmm. for God letting for Reverend Hampton letting God know, I need you. Oh, yes. I'm not going to rush. That's right. I don't care who's listening. That's right. If you don't want me to pray, don't ask me That's to pray. Right. That's right. That's God right. is so happy. Mm -hmm. I was talking to my friend, Pastor Flowers, mm -hmm. and she does this beautiful introduction mm -hmm. before she even gets ready to ask mm -hmm. God for anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And God is falling in love with that. Yeah. God is so excited. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When we tell him you are great and mighty. Oh, yeah. When we tell him we understand you are in full control. Oh, yeah. When we tell him there is nothing you cannot do. That's right. When we tell him we thank you That's for right. your agape love. That's right. When That's we right. tell him, Father God, we need you That's and right. no one else can supply our needs. That's right. When we tell him, mm -hmm. God, you are able. Oh, yes. You own everything. 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 And you bless your people That's right. that come to mm -hmm. you knowing who you are. That is right. We are out of order of our, our mm -hmm. session today, mm -hmm. but we don't care. That's right. God, we thank you for allowing thank us you, to Lord. sit in these seats. Mm -hmm. God, we thank you through the midst of thank Corona. You, you have God. given us finances to still thank sit you, here. Jesus. God, we thank you, thank you for God. as we walk with masks on. Mm -hmm. Can't hardly breathe. Jesus. We're waiting for the day yeah. that you reveal yeah. the cure That's that right. you already placed in a person. In the name Lord of Jesus. God, you already placed in yeah. a person. That's right. You just have a perfect time. That's right. That's Help right. Help us to understand your perfect time. That's right. For your ways are not our ways. That's right. And your thoughts are not our thoughts. That's right. As high as the heaven is from the mm -hmm. earth, mm -hmm. are your ways from our ways. That's right. We don't understand what you do. That's right. And we don't understand why you do it. But That's we right. do understand that mm -hmm. you are God. Mm -hmm. And beside you, there is no other. That's right. Lord, have mercy. That is right. Thank you, Jesus. God is so good. Thank you, God. You know, God Thank has you, his own time. That's right. You know, we are, we get in a rush. We want to heal right. in right now, right now. That's right, now. that's right, that's but, right. But some purpose, some reason, he allowed this to run this course that's right. until he said it's over. Reverend Hampton, mm -hmm. God mm -hmm. created the doctors. Yes, he did. The gift is in the mm -hmm. doctors. Mm -hmm. He mm -hmm. just hasn't decided to he reveal did. it yet. Exactly. And so that's why mm -hmm. we don't have a cure. That's right. This is just my belief. That's right. We cannot, mm -hmm. God placed it. God is not waiting to place the cure nope. in a person. Nope, it's all It's just a perfect timing. That's right, that's right. And people might say, mm -hmm. why did God allow all these people to die? Mm -hmm. We have to understand mm -hmm. what we were talking about, that will. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Christians, how many Christians die? A lot of Christians it's die. It's not when God, when things happen because of what man does, mm -hmm and God allows it. That's right. It doesn't mean the Christians are not going to have to deal with it. Right, right, right. There were Christians that passed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But we have to understand mm -hmm. God knows our day mm -hmm. and he knows our time. That's right. And Reverend Hampton, that mm -hmm. is so perfect because mm -hmm. when God gave you the name of this radio show, mm -hmm. you said the mm -hmm. Get Ready Evening Show. Mm -hmm. And people listen. It's not for you to get ready. Get that you should already be ready. That's right. This is not get ready. Mm -hmm. It is Reverend Hampton said, Val, we have got to be ready. You got to be ready. That's where this name came mm -hmm. from that God gave Reverend mm -hmm. Hampton. Mm -hmm. The get ready, meaning get ready for when Jesus comes back. That's right. So the all those Christians that passed through mm -hmm. this, we pray to God that they were ready. That they were ready. That's and they right. don't have to worry about it. That's right. We don't know the day. We don't know the time that it's going to be our number. That's right. We but we know. need to be, be ready. ready. That's right. That's right. We, we cannot wait to get ready. That's right. 
we got to be ready now. That's right. And we got to stay ready day by day. That's right. Day by day. That's I just right. want to read this, Reverend, our granddaddy. Thank you, Jesus. To kind of like back up what you said. Nothing was Thank made you. without the word. Everything that was created you, Jesus. received its life from him. And his life gave light to everyone. Yes, everything that was created was created by God. He spoke the word and everything came into existence. Yes, Lord. When he speak to whoever he gonna bring this spirit through, it's gonna happen. That's right. It's gonna happen. That's right. When he says so, that's what is gonna happen. That's right. He already know what the cure is. And for them, it may be an aha moment. Right. But it's not an aha moment for God. That's right. Because he knows what he is he doing. He knows what he's doing. Absolutely. There was another prayer. Mm -hmm. Valerie Howard sent a request. Mm -hmm. Pray for all those we lost during this COVID mm -hmm. pandemic mm -hmm. and praying for the churches. Mm -hmm. And so, mm -hmm. Father God, we pray for the yes, families God. Yes, God. of those who lost a loved one. Jesus. Father God, my sister said it a long time ago. Mm -hmm. The flesh grieves yes but the spirit rejoices thank yes. you father god yes, yes. that holy spirit that is mm. in us rejoices that's right and father god we know there are people that their heart is broken yes. we know father god that a piece of them mm -hmm. will never ever come back until we're somewhere around your throne father god we know that tears still cry for those that have been lost yes Father God, we ask you to strengthen each one of the mm -hmm. family members. Mm -hmm. We ask you to strengthen the spouses, oh God. That's right. We ask you to strengthen the loved ones, oh God. Mm -hmm. We ask you to equip them, oh God. Mm -hmm. And we ask you most and more importantly, oh God, that they, your, their eyes will be open unto you. Oh, yes. We ask you in the name of Jesus to yes, help Lord. them to understand that there's a God yes. that sent his only begotten son yeah. that went to prepare a place for us. Thank you. That where he is there, we may be also. Oh, yeah. So we pray for all those that lost mm -hmm. their loved mm -hmm. ones, oh, Father God. Yes. And Val said, can we pray for the churches? Jesus. We pray for every church, oh, every God, church that's God. open in your name. Every church, In the God. name of Jesus. In the name, in the of, name of the Father, Son, and the Holy oh, Spirit. Yes, God. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Oh, yes. We pray for every church that's oh, open yes. in your name. Oh, yes. Father God, we are living in detrimental times. Yes, God. And we do not take these seats for granted. Jesus. We thank you for the opportunity to place us thank here. Thank you, God. We thank you for the extra finances, oh, oh God. Oh, yes. We thank you for allowing us to know how important it is oh, yes. to spread you, God. Yes. In these evil oh, yes. times. Oh, yes. Oh, Help yes. the world to understand yes. that Biden and Kamala Harris mm -hmm. is not going to do it. That's right. You're going to be the one to oh, do it. Yes. Oh, yes. You're yes. going to be the one to give us a peace. Oh, yes. You're going to be the one to give us a joy. Yes. You're going to be the one to allow us to hold our heads up yes, and go yes. another day. That's right. You, Father God, mm -hmm. is going to bring peace. Yes. You, Father God, is going to bring healing. Oh, yes. Yes, oh, yes. Lord. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We cannot thank you enough. We can't thank you Father enough. God, we thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. My God. Hallelujah. We have been out of the churches. Mm -hmm. We have been do going through social media. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But it's nothing like being in the presence of nothing the Lord. Nothing like being Reverend in the presence of Reverend Hampton said, of find you a church. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Mm -hmm. If you live in Georgia mm -hmm. and you link into my Facebook page mm -hmm. live to hear the sermon. Oh, yes. But how will I come to you? That's right. Uh, that's all good. Mm -hmm. You can look in, you can learn, you can mm -hmm, grow. Mm -hmm. But for those that are near a church, that's right. You need to be in the building. That's right. When it's time to go back. That's right. When that pastor says we're going back mm -hmm. in, you need not sit at home and say, no, I'm going to listen to it on the Facebook mm -hmm, Live. Mm -hmm. You need to find a building mm -hmm. where the presence of Lord, of the oh, Lord sits. Yeah. Yes. where the presence of the Lord mm -hmm. saturates the place, mm -hmm. where you can feel that anointing, oh, yes. where you can feel that presence, mm -hmm. where you can touch and agree. That's right. That's yes, right. Lord. Touch and agree. So this social media is good, mm -hmm. but it's nothing like being in the presence of other believers. That's right. That are studying, mm -hmm. loving, submitted mm -hmm. to the word of God. Yes. And I'm telling you, I said it earlier, mm -hmm. it's a heart thing. Not what people see, not not what you dress like, not right. what you drive in. Nope. 
That's not going to do it. Mm -mm. That's not going to cut it. That's right. But it's the heart. That's right. It's in the heart. It's the heart. Mm -hmm. It's a heart thing. Mm -hmm. It's a heart thing. That's right. It, God knows the heart. Mm -hmm. And we have got to understand that. Oh, yes. Lord God, we thank you. Thank you, God. So we are going to get Lord. back to mm -hmm. the hot, hot topic. topic. Mm -hmm. The people's choice mm -hmm. or God's will. Mm -hmm. And if you want to call in to give us what you suggest it is or what you think it is, 609-807-2492. The people's choice or God's will. Mm -hmm. So Joe Biden and Kamala Harris mm -hmm. are the new president-elect mm -hmm. and VP. Mm -hmm. So we want to know. That's Do right. you think God allowed the people what they wanted? With was with, with familiar with Saul when the people wanted a king? Mm -hmm. Or God's will? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to tell you what I think. Okay. Whether God allowed the people to choose, mm -hmm. it is God's will. Mm -hmm. Because God allows the people to choose. Mm -hmm. So that still makes it God's will. Mm -hmm. So if God says, I'm going to let the people choose, that's God's will. Mm -hmm. That's God's will. So however you look at it, it's God's will. That's what I believe. God will allow us. If we think about Saul. The people wanted a king. God said, give them a king. He said, even show them what kind of king they're going to get. Hmm. And so God allowed the people. God allowed that to be his choice. Because if he didn't want it to happen, it wouldn't happen. Mm -hmm. And so we talk a lot about God's will. We're not going to get into that at this show. But we do understand. Mm -hmm. It was I believe it might have been Charles Stanley. I'm not sure that said today with Adam and Eve mm -hmm. people say why did he leave that tree in the garden mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because he wanted us to have free will mm -hmm. God don't want us to walk around like mummies or like mannequins or like robots mm -hmm. where he controls us mm -hmm. he wants you to love him with your heart mm -hmm. he wants you to come to him not because he makes you come to him, but because you want to come to him, mm -hmm. because you know who he is. Mm -hmm. so Reverend Gregor, I just want to say this. So, as we were coming close to the election, and we know, this was my prayer, we know what we desire mm -hmm. to have. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we was all frustrated with the sitting president now. Mm -hmm. And we knew we know what our desire was for him to get out of that office. So my prayer was, Lord, you know our desire. Yeah. But whatever your will is. What your will is, exactly. Because you know what? It was out of our hands. Exactly. exactly. Whatever his will was. That's right. That's what was going to happen. That's right. No matter what my desire was. Right. And see, I had the understanding of that. Mm -hmm. No matter what my desire was. Right. But whatever his will is. Exactly. We was going to have to accept whatever his will is. Exactly. I agree with that. Because he's in control. Exactly. And so everybody was um, celebrating yesterday. I was looking at it on CNN News, how everybody was celebrating in different cities all out in the street. Mm -hmm. They was uh, relieved, uh, thinking, you know, oh, we're going to get some peace now. Right. But what that makes me do is to watch more. That's right. Because as Christians, mm -hmm. we know that's right that this world got to come to an end. That's right. So it doesn't matter who's there. That's right. Whatever God's plan is. Exactly. To cause this world to come to an end, that, that person going to be in place. Exactly. So all we can say is whatever your will is. And that's why we say people's choice or God's will. That's right. It's God's will. It's whatever God's God will. decides to do, my granddaughter mm -hmm. said, Reverend Hampton, Naomi said the day before the election, mm -hmm. she said, Grandma, if Trump is in, mm -hmm. we're going to have a bad year. Mm -hmm. I said, boo-boo, I don't care who's in. No I'm going to have a blessed year. <laughs> 
That's right. I don't care who's there. That's right. Because God got me covered. That's right. And whoever, again, Mm -hmm. whoever got the position, Mm -hmm. that was God's will. That was God's will. That was God's will. That's right. And so I didn't care. I I did not want Trump to win again. Right. But if God allowed it, Mm -hmm. I'm going to have a blessed year. That's right. Because Trump doesn't stop me having a good year. doesn't control. What I'm goes blessed on in your life. And highly favored. That's right. Are you blessed? I'm blessed. And highly favored. And highly favored. Exactly. That's right. Yes, so I am. We highly just thank favored. God. We thank God for the new president and the new vice president. Mm-hmm. First woman. Mm. First woman of color. That's right. Awesome. It is. And awesome. she said, I'm the first woman, but I won't be the last. <laughs> she said that. She said, I won't be the mm-hmm. last. And so, she spoke it into existence. Yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. And so I look at little kids that had the eight years of President Obama, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. now have four more years mm-hmm. of an African-American female. Exactly. And some of the kids, people already said that. That's all they know. Mm-hmm. When they were born, when Trump, when uh, uh, Obama was in, mm-hmm. they only know a black president. Mm-hmm. And then they know Trump, mm-hmm. and now they know a female. Look at that. Black, that's all they know. That's all they know now. And so, mm-hmm. they need to know Jesus. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They need to know Jesus. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And they need to have parents that emulate Jesus. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And so, we are going to do, if you could call in, you got to write the number down because this is a trivial. Mm-hmm. So, I don't know if we're being able to call through. I'm not sure. But 609-807-2492. My sister, Mary Hager, she gave us Wawa gift cards back in March. But because of Corona, we were not able to give them away. So we're gonna give one away for the first three callers that call in. Mm. And you can have the same answer, we're, we're okay with that. That's right. But she wanted to be a blessing. So the trivial question, let me turn to it, comes out of John four, and Naomi picked the trivial question. So it comes out of John four, and it's verses 15, 16, and 17. So let's just read them. The woman saith unto him, oh, this is in reference to Jesus talks to a woman at the well. So we know that story, the yeah, woman we at know the that well. Story. So remember, you can win a Wawa gift card. Call in 609 807 2492. So this is John 4 with the woman at the well. Verses 15, the woman saith unto him, Sir, give me this water that I thirst not, neither come hither to draw. Jesus say unto her, Go call thy husband and come hither. The woman answered and said unto him, The trivial question is, What did the woman say? 609-807-2492. Now if you call in, you have to give us your address so we can either mail it to you, your phone number and address, so we can mail it to you or get it to you. It's only a $5 Wawa gift card, but you can get it. You might can get two donuts and a <laughs> cup of coffee. <laughs> two donuts. But they, but she gave us three cards. So 609-807-2492. So the woman answered and said, Trivial question, what did the woman say? What did the woman say? So that's our trivial question for today. Because you know we had our hot topic and we had our trivial question. And it's coming from John chapter 4. John chapter 4. And we're just looking at verses 15, 16. And the answer is in, I'm giving you a hint, 17. Now for those that had to go to the front of their Bible to look for John, <laughs> you need to be in church. <laughs> and that's okay. Let's say the question again. The question is, verse 15 and 16, the woman saith unto him, Sir, give me this water that I may thirst, not neither come hither to draw. Jesus saith unto her, Go call thy husband and come hither. The woman answered and said, The trivial question is, what did the woman say? 
So if you know the answer, give us a call. And even if you had to go to the front of the book to look up where the book of John is, that's okay. Because we had to do the same thing when we started studying the Bible. So take your time, find it, and call in. The number again is 609-807-2492. Okay. That's 609-807-2492. And one time, Reuben is back there controlling everything. He was a walk up. He walked up and gave the answer. <laughs> one time he walked in. <laughs> and I know Pastor Schaefer sometimes you have the walk up calls. <laughs> So we thank God for what he allows us to do. Amen. So we're going to give you your 15-minute sermon. And we like to say this is a nighttime treat to put you to sleep. This is a nighttime treat to put you to sleep. We love the Lord. Mm -hmm. We cannot do without him. And when I think about Reverend Hampton's prayer, I think about taking time with God. Mm -hmm. And even though the time I take with him now, I need to take more time. And so I love the thought of not rushing when it comes to Jesus, God. Jesus, that's right. Too many of us are in and out. Mm -hmm. And if we think about it, what if God was in and out? Mm -hmm. We have to get back. We have that's to right. get back. That anointing, that power comes mm -hmm. from spending time with God. Oh, yes. And mm -hmm. that's what's going to give us a joy, unspeakable joy. That's right. That's what's going to give Jesus. us a sweet, peaceful sleep. Mm -hmm. And so we have to understand that. And mm -hmm. so we're going to have our quick sermon, and mm -hmm. it's going to come out of Mark. But still call in. You have a few more minutes to call in because we're not, you know, just, just those like five more minutes to call in. Mm -hmm. But we need your name and your address so we can get the card to you. Because we love giving out little gifts, and we're going to mm -hmm. do more as we go along. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because one of the biggest things God wants us to do is to be about giving back. Mm -hmm. It's not all about us. Mm -mm. It can't be all about you. That's right. That's not, what if Jesus said, I'm not sending my son? No, no. Oh, my goodness. It cannot be all about you. There are people out there that need us we need each other we have to look around and see where we can help see that's what right. we can do that is it's right. all about kingdom building mm -hmm. not individual building that's right and so let's look at mark 15 and it's going to be the title is why would you turn back now give thanks so when we think about all the trouble that we have gone through because a Christian's life is not a piece of cake walk. And so when we think about all that we have gone through, why would you turn back now? Mm. Give thanks. Oh, yes. And oh, so yes. I chose that title because we're coming into the Thanksgiving season. Mm -hmm. And Reverend Hampton and I, for the Facebook people that are listening, we're only on the radio the second Sunday of the month 8 o'clock p.m. So mark that down. Second Sunday of the month, 8 p.m. So we won't see you again until after Thanksgiving. So Mark 15, 33 to 41. And why would you turn back now? Give thanks. So when we explain this text, when we look at the Gospels, the four Gospels, Jesus preached, he taught, and he healed. And so when we look at the Gospels, we see in this text, Mark 15, 33 through 41, we see that Pilate was governor and he turned Jesus over to be crucified. And so when we in the book of Mark, John Mark starts out with Jesus baptizing, and Jesus preaches, teaches, and heals. Jesus selects his disciples, and all through the Gospels, all through the Gospels, the religious leaders condemn Jesus. They try to trap Jesus. And I talked 
on Sunday, the other Sunday, with Pastor Flowers, the ones that were supposed to love him <laughs> were the ones that said crucify him. And so this is what Mark is all about. But Mark is fast paced. So Mark skips a lot of the detail. Yes, he's, he's So when we look at verse 34, let's look at 1534. And 34 says, and at the ninth hour, remember Pilate turned Jesus over to be crucified. And the religious leaders could not do it because they were under Rome authority. So they had to allow a Roman official, a Roman leader to condemn Jesus to death. They could not do it. And so when we look at 33, Jesus dies on the cross. And when the sixth hour was come, there was darkness over the whole land until the ninth hour. And at the ninth hour, Jesus cried with a loud voice saying, Eli, Eli, lama sabbatani, which is being interpreted, my God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? And so the commentator says with verse 1534, the physical agony for Jesus was horrible, mm. but the spiritual alienation from God was the ultimate torture. Mm -hmm. Being separated from God because Jesus took on our sins, mm. all the sins of the world. Mm -hmm. And check this out. There are some that have not even come to Jesus. Mm -hmm. Jesus took on their sins mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because he took on the sins of the world. The whole world. And so the commentator says, the physical agony was horrible, but the spiritual alienation from God was the ultimate torture. Mm. And we're aware, I want to ask the audience, are you aware that our worst agony is to be spiritually separated from God? Mm. The commentator says that was the worst thing. That was torture to Jesus, to be separated from his God. And so do we understand that's the worst thing for us is to be separated from our God. So when we think about it, Thanksgiving, my title is, why would you turn back now? Give thanks. So when we think about Thanksgiving is nestled in between Halloween and Christmas. Think about Halloween, spirits, witches, witchcraft, darkness, mm. demons. And Thanksgiving is nestled in between Christmas, the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And so when we think about this, Thanksgiving is a day of giving thanks. That's right. Why they put it a day? Because we cannot just thank him for one day. That's right. We understand that Thanksgiving represents of religious observance and traditional meals. It's the fourth Thursday in November, an annual holiday celebrating the harvest and blessing of the past year. Mm. So if that is the case, if Thanksgiving mm -hmm. represents the thanks of last year, mm -hmm. in 2020, we'll be giving thanks, I'm sorry, in 2021, mm -hmm. we'll be giving thanks for 2020. Mm -hmm. But look what we went through in 2020. That's right. So how can we still give thanks? Oh, yes. When we know that we serve a God that's in full mm -hmm. control. Mm -hmm. When we know that God is protecting us, that's covering right. us, directing us, and guiding us. That's right. When we know God loves us with an agape love. That's right. I love you so much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's how we give thanks. That's right. So when we look at the text, verses 33, I'm going to start at the top again. And when the sixth hour was come, there was darkness over the whole land until the ninth hour. And at the ninth hour, Jesus cried with a loud voice saying, Eli, Eli, lama sabbatani, which is being interpreted, my God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? And some of them that stood by, when they heard it said, behold, he calleth Elias. And one ran and filled a sponge full of vinegar and put it on a reed and gave him to drink saying, let alone, let us see whether Elias will come 
and take him down. Hmm. And Jesus cried with a loud voice and gave up the ghost. Mm -hmm. And the veil of the temp temple was rent in twain from top to bottom. Mm -hmm. And we know that veil that separated the holy of holies from the most holy. And so, and when the centurion which stood over against him saw that he so cried out and gave up the ghost, mm -hmm. he said, truly this man was the son of God. Mm -hmm. There were also women looking afar off, among whom was Mary Magdalene and Mary the mother of James, the mm -hmm. less of the Josephs, and Solomon, who also, when he was in Galilee, followed him and ministered unto him, and many other women which came up with him unto Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. My title for Jesus, mm -hmm. just imagine mm -hmm. Jesus saying, mm -hmm. I was born mm -hmm. of a virgin. Mm -hmm. I came, mm -hmm. I walked, mm -hmm. I taught, I prayed, mm -hmm. I hung for the Bible. For we understand, I like the way the songwriter says it, which relates to the Bible. Okay. They hung him high, mm -hmm. they stretched him wide. Mm -hmm. He hung his head yeah. and then he died. Oh yeah. So when we think about why would you turn back now? Right. So when we understand this text, we understand that Jesus said, when we look at the gospels, mm -hmm. Jesus said, Father, remove this cup from me. Mm -hmm. Nevertheless, your will be done. Mm -hmm. Not my will but your will be put done. That's right. And that's why I titled this, Why Will We Turn Back Now? Mm -hmm. Jesus would say, I was spit on. Mm -hmm. They smacked me. That's right. They wanted to throw me off the cliff. Yeah. They talked about me. Yeah. The people that were supposed to love me that's turned right. their back on me. That's but right. I kept that tunnel vision. Mm -hmm. I kept my mind stayed on the assignment that my God has given me. That's right. So why would you turn back now? That's right. Jesus, mm -hmm. why would you turn back now? Jesus. Just give God thanks. That's right. This is the Thanksgiving season. That's right. And in 2020, mm -hmm. we will be given thanks mm -hmm. for in 2021, yes. we will be given thanks for the prior year, That's 2020. Right. That's right. Where we stood by graves. Mm -hmm. Where we gotta deal with virtual and hybrid. Yes. Why we gotta deal with unemployment. That's right. Just give God thanks. That's right. I don't know about you. Yeah. But God gave us That's his right. only begotten son. That's right. Give God thanks. Oh yeah. When we look at this, mm -hmm. Psalm 118, 1, mm -hmm. give thanks to the Lord. Oh, yeah. For he is good. Mm -hmm. He his love endures forever. Oh yeah. That means he will not <laughs> stop loving you. That's right. His love endures forever. Oh yeah. First Thessalonians 518. Give thanks in all circumstances. Mm -hmm. So in 2020, yeah. we will be thanking him. Yeah. For some of us came up positive. That's right. But two weeks later, yeah. we were negative. Yeah. I don't know about you. Mm -hmm. Give God thanks. That's when right. we look at Colossians 3, 17. Mm -hmm. yes. And whatever you do in word or deed, mm -hmm. do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus, mm -hmm. giving thanks to God, yes. the Father through him. Yes. I don't know about you. Yeah. Father God, mm -hmm. Jesus, Holy Spirit, yeah. we give you thanks yeah. for helping us to wake up another day, yeah. for helping us to put one foot in front of the other, That's right. for helping us to put an arm mm -hmm. in the sleeve That's of right. our shirt That's with right. no assistance. Father God, we say thank you, thank you. for this season. Yeah. Psalm 100, mm -hmm. 105. Make a joyful noise unto mm -hmm. the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Yeah. Come before his presence with singing. Yes. Know ye that the Lord, he is good. Mm -hmm. It is he that hath made us and not we ourselves. Yeah. We are his people mm -hmm. and the sheep of his pastor. Reverend Hampton, mm -hmm. enter into his gates yeah. with thanksgiving. Yeah. Yes, Lord. Thank we you. thank you. Enter mm -hmm. into his courts with praise. Thank Be you. thankful unto him thank and you. bless him. His name, yeah. Jehovah Jireh, yeah. my provider, yeah. Jehovah Salome, mm. God, you are our peace, yeah. Jehovah Nisi, yeah. God, you are our victor, yeah. God, we love you, Thank we God. cannot do without you, oh, yeah. Psalm 107.1, yeah. oh, give thanks to the Lord, mm -hmm. for he is good, oh, for yeah. his steadfast love mm -hmm. endures forever, oh, yeah. Psalm 156, mm. let everything that has <laughs> breath 
Praise ye the Lord. <laughs> I don't know about you. Why would you turn back now? Amen. When God brought you through Corona. That's right. God brought you through unemployment. That's right. God made a way out of no way. Yeah. God woke you up this yeah. morning. God allowed your loved one oh, yeah. to come home mm -hmm. from a sick bed. Yeah. God allowed somebody you know yeah. to test positive mm -hmm. and later test negative. Yeah. Father God. We give you thanks. Thank you, we Lord. cannot do without you. Thank you. But Lord, you brought us through COVID-19. Mm -hmm. You brought us through the election. Oh, yes. You brought us through sitting by a grave site. Yes. You brought us through virtual and hybrid. Father God, you brought us through lost jobs. Father God, you gave us mm. a way oh, yes. when our money was less thank than you. our bills. Thank you. For that, we say thank you. Thank you. you. Our heart is still beating. Mm -hmm. Our heart is still in love with mm -hmm. you. Our heart still cannot do without oh, you. Yes. We give you thanks, oh Thank God. You, Lord. Even if you did not allow us to be able to pay our bills, yeah. you said you are our provider. Oh, yeah. Help us to trust in you. Oh, yeah. Somebody might have went lacking this month. Yeah. Trust in God. Thank you. Someone may not know mm -hmm. where the money is coming from next month. Yeah. Trust God. Mm -hmm. Someone may not know if their loved one is going to come out of the hospital, mm -hmm. trust God. Oh, yes. Someone may not know mm -hmm. where their child is tonight. Thank trust you. God. That's Someone right. does not know if I can get off this alcohol. Jesus. Trust God. That's right. Someone is shaking mm -hmm. in the midst of getting ready to take drugs. Yeah. Trust God. Yeah. Thank Why would God. we turn back now? That's right. When God has brought us through all mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. just give thanks thank you lord unto god mm -hmm. and his three forms yes father mm -hmm. son mm -hmm. and holy, holy spirit. spirit we cannot thank separate you. the two thank you we cannot separate jesus from god That's right. so many people are saying thank god mm -hmm. thank god for sending his only begotten son That's right. now if you want to call in mm -hmm. the call in number is 609 Oh, yeah. 807 mm -hmm. 2492. Yes. Is there one mm -hmm. who wants to confess mm -hmm. our Lord and Savior? Thank you, Lord. Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. You want to give your life oh, yeah. to Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. The Bible says if you confess with your mouth yes. the Lord Jesus Christ Thank you, Lord. and believe that God raised him from the dead, mm -hmm. you can be saved. That's right. We ask you to call in. We ask you to get in contact. Reverend Hampton and I are on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Cheryl Hampton, mm -hmm. Valerie Granberry. Thank contact you, us. Mm -hmm. we, we are excited for Joe Biden and his yes. vice president. Yes. But we are a thousand times more excited, more excited. about a soul right. that comes to Jesus Christ. That's right. God is so excited mm -hmm. when someone says, mm -hmm. I need Jesus. That's right. And believe it or not, mm -hmm. if it is laid on your heart mm -hmm. to give your life to Christ, yes. it is not you seeking God. That's right. It is God seeking you. That's right. It is God seeking mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. It is God seeking mm -hmm. you. Don't let anybody talk you out of it. Don't hold your heart. If you can't get a hold of us, mm -hmm. find a pastor That's right. that believes in the Father, Son, and the Holy, and Spirit. the Holy Spirit. The Son is Jesus Christ. Find a pastor who believes in God mm -hmm. and the God that sent his only begotten Son. Yes. And, believe, and, and, and find a pastor mm -hmm. that believes that Jesus and God are one. Amen. They are one. Man. Don't let anybody talk you out of that. Mm -hmm. Don't let you'll learn, mm -hmm. you'll grow. You may mm -hmm. not understand it now. Mm -hmm. There's so much that Reverend Hampton and I don't understand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. But every day you study. That's right. Like I said, whoever was going back to the front to find John, mm -hmm. you keep doing that. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. after you keep doing that, you'll mm -hmm. know right where John mm -hmm. is. And I just want to add, no matter how many times you read the word. Thank you, Lord. No matter how many Thank years you, you read the Thank Word of God. My grandkids asked me, my granddaughter said, Mama, do you read the Bible all the time? Thank you, Jesus. So 
And then we read a story that we read before, and I just said to her, no matter how many times Thank you, God. we read the Bible, is the Lord show you something new. That's right. You can read that same story. That's right. And he'll give you something new in that same story. That's right. And I told her we have to keep reading. That's right. So we can keep the story straight. That's right. So we can remember. That's right. So if it ever come a time. That's right. That the Bibles are taken away. That's right. We'll have it in our hearts. That's right. And we'll have it in our minds. That's right. And that's the reason why we read the word of God. That's right. He'll give you understanding if you want it. That's right. You, you, you won't need social media mm -mm. to look up the verses. Mm -mm. You will have it in your heart. That's right. You have that it in your right. heart. That is right. Thank and just Jesus. like we saw the people celebrating yesterday. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, my goodness. They were celebrating before they called it. That's right. We saw them dancing in the street in Philly. Thank you, Jesus. We saw the people celebrating. Thank you, Lord. And imagine Thank when you, you come to Jesus. Oh, yes. Imagine the angels in heaven. Yes, Lord. Oh, glory! Celebrating, Celebrating of a soul. That's right. Surrender uh, unto Jesus. That's right. Oh, that's my right. goodness. That's imagine right. that. That's right. If you think you saw celebrating yesterday, yes, God. imagine the angels in heaven yes, God. celebrating yes, God. over a lost soul. That's right. Coming to Jesus. That's right. Surrendering to that's our right. Savior. That's right. Oh, yes. That's right. Oh yes. And so listeners, mm -hmm. I know you see me, you took my took my mask off. <laughs> but Reuben has sanitized this mm -hmm. area. He has sanitized our mics. Mm -hmm. And so I just want the audience to know we are definitely following guidelines. Mm -hmm. But we Reuben has sanitized. Mm -hmm. We have cleansed. Mm -hmm. And so we understand. Mm -hmm. Reverend Hampton said the angels in heaven rejoice. Mm-hmm. Because we are talking about eternal life. Jesus. Not four years for a president. Mm -hmm. We're talking about eternal. Mm. Eternal. And mm. just so everyone knows, there is a mm. heaven and there is a hell. Mm -hmm. And each and every person that's ever mm. been on earth is going to one or the other. That's right. And, and the equivalents with those are, mm -hmm. they're both eternal. That's right. That's the equivalent. That's what that makes them equivalent. Right. So right. we are going to be with our Lord and Savior, mm -hmm. Jesus Christ, or in hell, mm -hmm. eternally tormented. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's what we believe 100%. Mm -hmm. And that's why you cannot separate God from Jesus. That's right. That and so right. we asked you, mm -hmm. this is our sole purpose for being mm -hmm. here, is to understand mm -hmm. that we belong to God. That's right. And this is our assignment. Mm -hmm. So we thank mm -hmm. you so much for tuning in. Mm -hmm. This is our first time since Corona. Mm -hmm. And I'm telling you, we drilled Reuben about those sanitation. <laughs> and he hooked us. He said, mm -hmm. nobody's been in there for four or five hours. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to worry about it. I cleansed mm -hmm. everything. And we believe that God has us covered. Oh, yes. And no matter what we go through, mm -hmm. we trust in God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the, mm -hmm. the key is, did you catch that? what we go through that's right and that's the key we're not stuck mm -hmm. we're going through it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and jesus said i will never leave you nor forsake you that's right so he's going through it with us mm -hmm. and so reverend hampton can you close i us? just i just want to say we thank god for reverend granberry powerful sermon thank tonight you, Jesus. oh thank my you, goodness lord. giving thank thanks you. unto the lord Give thanks. you know when one thing I thought about as we close, yeah, I thought about one day that we don't know what all God is protecting us from throughout the day. That's right. We don't know what That's God right. is protecting us from. That's right. We don't know how much. That's right. How much we need God. That's right. Because we are danger seen, seen and, and danger unseen. unseen. That's right. We don't know. That's right. And God is protecting us all through the day. That's right. He's just providing for us. That's right. We don't know how much That's right. we need to give God That's right. thanks. That's right. And so I thank you for that sermon tonight. Thank you, Jesus. And so I just want to uh, give you um, what the hot topic is going to be about next next um, time we come, the next second Sunday in December. Uh, we will be talking about the hot topic is what really matters in this life what really matters to you 
Does it matter to have all the material things you can accumulate? That's right, that's right. What really matters? I want you to think about that so you have an answer. And we want to give you the answer to John 4. Mm -hmm. John 4, 17. The woman answered and said, I have no husband. So that was the trivial question. Mm -hmm. What did the woman say? She said, I have no husband. I have no husband. And we know <laughs> that woman. What you laughing at? Laughing at that woman. <laughs> oh, okay. I have no husband. <laughs> she had how many? Five. All right. <laughs> and Jesus said, the one you with now, not even yours. Exactly. And so, audience, <laughs> Jesus told this woman. Mm -hmm. This woman didn't tell Jesus her life. Mm -hmm. Jesus mm -hmm. told her mm -hmm. her life. Mm -hmm. And so Jesus knows everything you have gone through. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. woman said, I have no husband. <laughs> Listen to this. For the woman answered and said, I have no husband. Jesus said unto, the, unto her, thou hast well said, mm -hmm. I have no husband. Mm -hmm. For thou hast five husbands, mm -hmm. and he whom thou hast now mm -hmm. is not thy husband. <laughs> In that saith mm -hmm. thou truly. <laughs> Jesus said, you are telling the truth. And audience, listen. He knows when you're telling a lie. Oh, yeah. That's why I love him. You know what? He just blows me away exactly. when he do things like that. Exactly. When I start laughing, my grandkids look at me when I'm reading the Bible. Yeah. He blows me away. He does. I'm telling you, because he already knew what he the answer was. Knows. He just going to wait and see what you're going to say. But how about, Cheryl, <laughs> how about when Sarah uh -huh. laughed, when God yeah. said you're going to have a child, yeah. and Sarah laughed, yeah. and Sarah said, I didn't laugh. Uh -huh. He said, oh, yeah, yes, you laughed. <laughs> and Sarah <laughs> laughed within herself. That's right. She didn't even laugh out loud. That's right. So God knows yes, what you've does. been through. Yes, he does. He uh, knows everything. My cousin, my cousin, <laughs> my cousin, my cousin. I always tell this, and her mm -hmm. name is Leslie. Mm -hmm. We call her Suki, mm -hmm. and I'm going to put her on blast right now. <laughs> God knows mm -hmm. what you've been through. Oh, yeah. And I'm telling you, you want to see a praiser? Uh-huh. She, she said, the devil tried to get me, uh -huh. but the devil is a liar. <laughs> he said, I'm God's child. All right. God Praise knows God. what you went through. He knows. He knows what you're going to go he through knows. tomorrow. Oh, he knows. We didn't know who was going to be the president-elect. Mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm. But you can best believe God knew. He knew it. And he so, knew it. Cheryl, before we close out, mm -hmm. can we pray for the radio station? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, and then we want to say happy Thanksgiving to happy everyone. Happy Thanksgiving. And we hope you tune in. The next time, God bless you, and we're going to pray, and after that, we'll say good night. Why would you turn back now? Why would you Give turn thanks. back now? Father God, we come to you right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you right now that thank you, you oh God, have thank this radio you, station thank covered. You, yes, Lord. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Thank you have God. it covered, God. Oh, yes. We pray that you continue to bless this radio yes, station. Yes, Lord. Continue yes, Lord. to bless yes, those yes, that Lord. run this our radio yes, station, God. God. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You're able to yes, open Lord. doors for them, oh, God. Oh, yes. Oh, God, we pray in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, oh, Lord. yes. Oh, yes. Lord. If you will do God. big and mighty things, oh, God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Right here in this radio yes, station, Lord. God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Right yes, here. Lord. Right here. Oh, yes. Lord Jesus. Yes, God. And so, Father, we yes, pray Lord. in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus bless. Name. Yes, Lord. Bless this place, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. As we lift yes, up the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, God. Oh, yes. As you yes, give God. us the freedom. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, Lord. Yes, Yes, your holy oh, yes. and righteous name. Mm, thank oh, you, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Jesus. Oh, yes. Thank you, Lord. Bless it, God. Yes, Lord. Oh, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And it shall be blessed. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Yes. Amen. 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 Thank, Amen. You, Jesus. thank you, Holy Ghost. Good night, listeners. Thank you, Lord. Spread the word. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Second Sunday of the mm -hmm. month, 8 p.m., mm -hmm. a midnight treat, a mm -hmm. evening treat thank to you, put God. you to sleep. Mm -hmm. From 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. Mm -hmm. The Get Ready Evening Chill. Oh, yes. Blessed by God. Oh, yes. God of Abraham. Oh, yes. God of Isaac. Oh, yes. God of Jacob. Yes. The Son. Mm -hmm. Jesus. All right. Yes, Lord. And the I promise keeper. Hey. That's right. Glory. Thank you. Amen. Thank Good you. night. Jesus.